Okay, right. You know, maybe. Yeah, 200 fucking pretty awesome. 220 is even better, but then again. Right, can I ditch myself and be happy with the result? I think I can. How, where, where's the. Yep, there we go. I, I'm happy with that. So, RCS. Thrust my way out. Um, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. What have we here? Why can't I get out? This is very bad. Oh crap! This is very bad indeed. Damn it, Sky Crane! What happened? Oh no! Do I restart the mission or do I carry on? Oh no! Gutter! Absolute gutter! So, I have nothing that can... Jeb! Jeb! EVA! Get the fuck out of the way! You've got to save yourself! You've got to save yourself! Can you save yourself? I don't know if you can, you're going up like 200 meters a second. Oh god, you're going to use every last bit in this fucking RCS pack of uh, fuel to save yourself. Oh no, Jebediah no! Oh no, this is it. Game over man, game over. Puff. <laughs> no way. Restart flight. Oh god, right, I need to go back and check the stage in. Something went horribly wrong question is though, what went horribly wrong? Uh, end flight, vehicle assembly building, right okay so this isn't good, this isn't good at all. Right, okay so that is, god that's that part under there okay so that's that thruster there so it will jettison that that and that activate the thrusters disengage the shield and what is okay so that is right so what the hell happened Um. Right, okay, so apparently nothing went wrong there, but I'm not convinced, so we're going to take this out again, we're going to try it again. Oh, fucking God. Oh, dear God. Well, at least, at least I'll be able to um, straight shoot for the moon again, and we know the thing actually gets there. So, throw it up there, I think. Uh, Sass on. Yep, impatience is a virtue. I'm gonna do the gravity burn, gravity turn a little bit more this time, more than what it was. Oh god, Jebediah brought back from the dead again. It was all a bad dream, my friend, it was all a bad dream. But don't worry, you'll soon be there. Look at you, picking up speed like no one's business. This thing is an absolute beast. It's like the Heavy Delta rocket, in all fairness. Very much so. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, Alright, I'm going to be ready to ditch those fuels in a second. Those uh, solid fuel boosters. Swing! Gone. Happy days. Alright, so... You're going to stand there and wobble around a little bit, I suppose. But no matter, we are going to adjust our arc. And we're going to go up a bit more like that. Ah, lovely. See, this thing picks up speed like no one's business. It's an extremely efficient rocket. Very quick, very dirty, and I like it. I like it a lot. Ah, Jebediah. Shame you can't see out the windows, matey. I mean, you've seen this view a thousand times by now. Surely, surely I've done at least a thousand launches. Maybe not in my videos, but definitely over the amount of time that I've played it. I've done quite a few launches, but uh, 
yeah, this game's been a hell of a hell of a fucking good one for me. Oh god, right, map time. That's, you know what, I'm going to fly this by map for this because it does my head in when I don't. I'm going to have a quick sip of me Cherry Lucas aid. Mm. It's good stuff. If you've got access to it, I suggest you try it. Unless you don't like cherries, then I wouldn't recommend it at all. Right, okay, so, same things happening again here. I'm going to quickly throw a rocket down here. Let's see if we can get ourselves like a much better orbit out of it this time. I mean, we still ditched this with quite a lot of fuel left in it. This time, I don't want to do that again. I mean, height is casually dropping, but at least we're over 100,000. Fifteen, yeah. Look at that go now. Come down to about there. All right, give yourselves a little boost. A little boost to two hundred. Nice. Okay, so we've got a little bit of fuel left. So it looks like we're getting to do our transfer burn all over. So you know what? I'm not even going to need to build the apo. I should think. Not the Apo, the Perry, because we will be doing straight shot burn, I think. Alright, okay. How are we doing? No moon yet, so... What I'm going to do is I'm going to give myself a little bit of thrust to help myself turn with. I really should include a massive RCS tank. That's what I should have done back when I was checking the staging, but that meant taking the rocket apart again, and nobody wants that. Uh, right, okay. Hold yourself there. Okay, right, moon's poking up, so it's time to put your arse in gear and get yourself to it. Alright. Let's see how this does this time. It's probably not going to last the entire burn saying that, but I'm not worried, I'm not phased. Alright, okay, so... Um, Casual. Now, I need to find out why my RCS weren't thrusting me outwards like, you know, it's supposed to. In fact, I'm probably going to have to figure out a way of sorting this out. Uh, uh, stop sassing, you're going to hit the bloody thing. Alright, just give yourself the activation and thrust yourself away just a little bit. There you go, you're away, so that's good news, let's go back to the moon, yeah! There goes another rocket off to its destiny. There's a space letter, which I don't like, which is boo, but never mind, let's get to the old oh god. <laughs> Jeez, how far am I away from it this time? And there's my last one. Space litter. There is no periapsis, so we're going to go to the pro, which is now the retro, and we're going to hold ourselves on it very nicely and thrust. Bring ourselves nice and down and round. This is a very, very, very different thing than last time, isn't it? Last time we were extremely close and we had to adjust for it like that, but now we've got the opposite end of the scale, now we're too far away. But the Perry's doing its job, 40,000, yeah, okay. Look at all those Capollo pieces, man. Jesus Christ. So yeah, they're going to be forever stuck now, I, I should imagine. God damn it. Space litter! Alright, get to that Perry Perry. And... Alright, that's everyone else said on Pro, so we're going to go... Here. 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 Why am I not on entirely on it? I'm trying to angle it down. But I think that's angling it up, so we're going to go this way, I think. Yes, much better. Mucho better, though. Um, how do I get more northwards? Is it? I'm going to need it to be on the marker. I should. S yes, just like that, I imagine. Okay. 
sweet. So landing site picked out. Um, same thing again, me thinks. I'm going to go to the retro and now going to ditch this. All right, see the bit. Wicked. So here we go. Same thing as before. Hopefully, this won't, you know, foul us up too much again. I do need to work out a way of getting that out. Of course, it needs retros attached to it, and there's some. Re oh. oh, god damn it. Never mind, never mind. Right, okay, so yeah, that's definitely that one. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get myself over the thing and then I'm going to slow myself down with it partially, I reckon. Alright, okay, so uh, this is it, isn't it? Damn it. I went too far. Oh no, 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 that's the wrong way. Damn it. Okay, so Sky Queen's going to have to do a bit more adjusting than I had originally anticipated. Damn it. Alright, thrust, thrust. You're going over the crater now. Yes, you can see because this has a similar to the Min Mist thing. Oh, fucking bleh, bleh, if I can actually talk. Um, this has a Min Mist nipple. <laughs> that's what I was trying to say. Uh, okay, so. Uh, okay. You're doing well, you're doing well for yourself. Say, so you take yourself down to 200, then we're gonna. Well, no, actually, we're gonna go down to 100 this time. Because we've missed the mark by quite a bit here. So. Although we seem to be now quite going for it. So, I'll do this. We're gonna try this again. I'm gonna jettison. And we're gonna RCS out. No, no, that's the wrong one. I need to get out of here. Right, okay, how bad's this gonna? Oh god, what's happening? Now this is dangerous, but I'm not gonna complain. Jesus Christ! I put the shits up me that did. All right, Sky Crane, go activate. to hold your position. I need you to fall at the Mimbus nipple. Yes, yes, yes. Nice, nice. Okay, that's perfect. Sky Crane doing its duty. Let's see how well this is going to land. Be very interesting to say the least. Oh, look at that over there, that's quite nice. Now, is this the right crater? Yes, I am double checking and checking and double checking. Uh, okay, so 6,000 meters, I'm going at a sizable speed, so it's time to start adjusting, I believe. Yeah, look at it, it drops us like no one's business. Well, it drops the speed anyway. Not us. We don't want it to drop us, that's what that's the last thing we want it to do. Alright, can I adjust myself with RCS here? The RCS does fuck all in this thing. Seriously, like what's the problem with it? Why Because it hasn't got any RCS ports on it. Fucking Jesus. No wonder it wouldn't get out of that. I'm sure I put some RCS ports on it. Holy bejesus. I can't believe that. That's just well messed me up. But anyway. Right, I believe there's a moonolith on that nipple there. And I believe that's it there that we're looking at right there. It could also be that little dimmer thing there. But never mind. Seven minutes of terror. This has been seven minutes of terror. This entire flight has been seven minutes of fucking terror. Uh, I need you to be, you, you have to be on that centre, you can't throw me off here, this is very important. I'm also quite a distance away from that, further than what I'd like to be driving up to it, 
but never mind. Alright, here we go. Go on, you can do it. You can do it. Sky Queen, your way to victory. God, it's quite far away. I've got to go over a mound or two. Oh well. A bit of adventure never hurt you ever die, did it? Alright, more for us, more for us. Okay, yes. We're getting there, we're getting there. See you in a bit! You've served your purpose well. Uh, where did that go? That best not be coming back down on top of me, otherwise I'm going to be slightly miffed. I suppose what I should do is I should get out of here, really. But yeah, this is the new MCV, and it's sweet. Let's go. It's also a lot more sturdier than the other one. Mainly because it's built on the Curiosity style pod rather than the um, Tosh's cart. I don't think it's as fast as well, and it also, because of the extra wheels that turn like that, it's got a bit more control over it. So I'm not in fear of my life if it's actually going to spin over at the first opportunity, albeit very, very, it is very, very slow. As you can tell here, and because of the lack of two times speed, there's no way of me speeding this up. So let's just go for it and hope for the best. You never know. There may not even be a moonolith here. I'm damn sure there is because according to the mapper, which for various reasons I couldn't attach to this thing because it wouldn't have fit inside the pod, it's in the very centre of this crater and there, I can see no moon arch. I can see no moon arch anywhere on this crater. Nothing shows up at all. How are we doing? We're making good progress. We're making good progress indeed. Jebediah enjoying this little trek on the moon, giving this full systems a full workout. In all fairness, he's just happy for the bit of solitude in all fairness. He's just, you know, Bill and Bob constantly going on at him not to fucking go so fast. He's, he's had enough and these moon missions are certainly the way forward for him to have a bit of a break. very nice and quiet on the moon but it won't be soon because pretty soon we're going to start sending up some drills and hope and hopefully the vacuum of space will stop poor Jeb from suffering the noise Um, why is my speed dropping? am I pressing the wrong button here? yeah I am, I'm pressing the wrong button carry on but we're almost at this mound I'm sure this is the centre mound it looks like the highest point although this could have been it that I've just wheeled over but I wouldn't count on it I'm definitely going to assume this is it. Yes, it looks like it from the angle we're going at. Let's also do a bit of a zoom out, see what we can see. Yeah, that, that has to be it. Can I see anything that looks like a moonolith on there? Now it's either a rock or a moonolith, I don't know. Or is that it there? I, I think that could be it there. I didn't equip a moonlift detector on it either. In true Kerbal fashion, I've come proper unprepared for this. <sighs> Fucking hell, they're struggling to get up this hill. Don't worry. Your struggle will soon be fulfilled, as you will realise there's a great gift at the top of this hill. At least I hope there's a great gift. I hope it's not that one that's buried under the floor somewhere. That will really knock me off. Because then I'll start this base operation business for nothing. And I'll start it all again for nothing. And these last three flights that I've just done will be for nothing. Alright. What can we see? What can we see? Right, okay, there is a moonolith up here somewhere. There's got to be a moonolith. Wait, wait, oh! Hello! Aha! Aha! My first ever found moonolith on the moon! So here, here's where one of you bastards have been hiding. Alright. I've got to you, you motherfucker. Sweet! Let's have a good look at this. Don't go too close. You never know what it could be. 
could short out all our electrical systems. Oh, Jeb, you silly bugger. <laughs> Get up. And of course. RCS packing the way is the way forward, so let's have a good bow, bow, bow at this. Whee! Alright. Bit of shameless promotion there, squad. But what does it do? What does it mean? Whatever could it mean? What do they do? Who knows? We'll need to build some sort of research station to check it out. I mean, there is one next that we could go check next to the um, space center, but that's boring. And the one on Minmus is just too hard to get by a long shot because it's floating; it floats above the surface. What kind of bullshit is that? Let's see if I can get myself back in here. Aha! We're aboard. All right, so now we're actually here. It's time to engage the next stage of the mission. Space Center. Where's those supplies? Um, Apollo Heavy Supplies. Good news, good news. Okay, so let's see what we can do here. Uh, deliver cargo. Oh, look at that! The drill controls are crashing. You know what? I don't even give a shit now. They can stay there. Or can they? Yeah, they can stay there for all I care. Right. Provided they don't get him away too much like they are doing right now. Alright, here we are. Let's see. We're on the 90 line, so I need to adjust this with south or north or north or south. I think it's... We'll go, we'll, no, I think it's north, if I remember correctly, from last time. Right, okay. Uh, too fast. Right, okay. Nice. Hold yourself there for us and thrust up. Yes, it was that way. But of course. Jesus Christ. How do I sort this out now? Because I don't think it's going to. No, I honestly don't think it's going to. Right, okay, so. Let's see what we can do here. How, how are we doing for fuel? We're doing quite good for fuel. Alright, try here. Just, just, just try here. Fucking goddamn drill controls. A pain in my ass. Why? Why? Why did he just have to be in the way? I know that's the wrong way. This sucks. Hopefully when I've actually built these things, the drill controls won't take up my screen like this. Because I'll be switching between the two of them. And because I've, uh, because there are two on the screen, then I really won't be getting confused between which one's which. Uh, one on the screen even. Jesus, I'm getting confused with what I'm saying. It's just really off-putting to have that in the centre of the screen. How are we doing for fuel? Good. Good enough. I'm not liking that juddery business. I saw I saw that it affected the orbit then as well, but we got here okay, under worse conditions. Okay, so how high do you reckon we're gonna be here? We need to be we need to be fucking very, very low. Right, okay. There now. That's pro. I need I need to get retro in very, very quickly. And hopefully it'll stay in the position that I've told it to. Alright, nice. See, ideally I need to be disappearing over that crater, which is... I can't see it on the horizon yet. But that doesn't necessarily mean it's a good thing. Hold on, hold on a second. Is my orbit changing here? It's not, no. So I need to... I need to get down very, very low. Nice, okay, so... 
Let's see how well this does, shall we? This is going to be interesting, to say the least. Be ready for that retro burn, my friend. Oh, wow. So, um, yeah, let's see if we can actually do this. Alright, turn. Alright, so we might actually do this, so here we go. Yes, we're going to be within 10 kilometers pretty damn soon. Nice, we can deliver the cargo. So, deliver. Sweet! There goes the drill controls. Alright, so next off, we're going to get rid of this. It's too deadly to be just hanging around. Okay, there you go. Completely out of the way of the uh, MCV. Sweet! <laughs> Um, we're going to get rid of that window as well, orbital operations. And we've delivered cargo, so, you know, we can ditch that. Alright. Sky Crane, you did your duty and you did it well. Happy days. I'll be using more of you in the future. So, thank you very much, Ma'am Command Pod, for your hard work. But your job is over, it's time to destroy oneself. So. People, with this mission now complete, I'm going to start building shit and I'm going to check out what the space dock has to say for itself. So, I don't know how long this one's been, it might be a long one, it might be a short one, depending on how long I've been sat here recording for. But um, if you like, leave a like. If you're feeling fruity, leave a comment. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. So, until next time, ladies and gentlemen. Da -da -da. Peace out. That was beautiful.